What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. This is um, a sign reading for Virgo for mid-July of 2022. This will resonate via Virgo in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general reading for sign of Virgo. I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node signs as well for additional message or messages. Uh, these are psychic and prophetic messages, so one message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else, so you have to plug it in your own particular life and situation, however it resonates and applies for you, if it does. Okay, Virgo? Um, I heard you next, and I, I got some channel messages for you, so your sign's up next. Now, this is for mid-July of 2022 to end of July, but for some, it could start resonating now. For some, after July, there's 7 point something, something billion people in the universe and tons of Virgos. So, you know, you have to plug yourself in where you fit, okay? Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. There's 13,300 of you, you guys on the channel right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's Hybrisis 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash out, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Okay. <clears throat> so the channel message I received for, well, there was a couple. But the first one I heard was... Um, a cancer, a very significant cancer in a Virgo's life is about to start getting very ill soon. Um, I heard cancer feminine. I heard for some it was your secret lover, your um, your very much in the public eye reader. Um, that was for one of you guys. Um, for one, it is um, a family member. For one, is a family member. Um, that was the first one. So... Um, a very significant cancer femme is about to start getting very ill. Um, she is significant in your life and subject for more fashion verbs. She could have cancer in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, hammer, Jupiter charts. For one, you are a very popular online public platform reader, Virgo. You are. And the cancer femme was, uh, is or was a secret lover of yours. So homosexual relationship, femme to femme, I'm presuming. Maybe for some. For some, it could be fem uh, femme to masculine. Um, I just heard Virgo, so you could be a masculine or a Virgo. How that resonates and applies, Virgo. Okay, for the online pop popular social media platform, Virgo. Okay, um, you could be masculine or femme, but it's a very significant. You're both very popular online social media platform people, but she she was a secret a secret lover of yours online popular social media platform, Virgo. Masculine or femme, Virgo, but she is a Cancer femme. Okay, that's one. The second one, you're a family member. She's a family member of yours. So you're a Virgo, and it's a cancer feminine family member of yours. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit, okay? Whether you're the online popular social media platform Virgo reader, and it was a secret uh, cancer fem lover, either currently or in the recent or in the past, sorry, or you are a Virgo, masculine or feminine, and it is a cancer feminine family member. But either way, the cancer femme is significant, and she's about to start coming very ill. I didn't hear what kind of illness it was. You have to plug it in your own life, how it resonates, okay? That was the first one. The second one, I heard um, discrimination in a workplace is about to become very, very, very significant in Virgo's life. That was the second one. So discrimination in a workplace is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. So some kind of discriminatory behavior. It could be you. That has um, brought upon this discriminatory behavior or somebody you're connected to brought it upon you or you're on the sidelines of this discriminatory behavior in a workplace. Now, discrimination is a no-no. That's like, um, that's a huge no-no. That's like uh, lawsuit energy. And that's just the truth. Um, that's like going to the EEOC energy right there. Um, you can't discriminate against race or gender or age or sexual orientation or um or religion um in a workplace and that's just the truth um th that's seriously like eeoc energy um now energies can reverse so only you know if you have discriminated against somebody or or somebody's discriminated against you or, or you're on the sidelines of someone being discriminated against, only you know 
how this applies in your life and not anybody else, Virgo. But some kind of discriminatory energy is about to become very significant in Virgo's life in a workplace. So whether you have discriminated or somebody discriminated against you or, um, or you're on the sidelines, I feel somebody might get the EEOC involved. Um, possibly. You plug it in how it resonates, Virgo. Anybody who doesn't know what the EEOC is, you can Google it. It's um, a place you can go if your workplace or uh, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, you're having severe workplace issues and um, there's discriminatory behavior, basically. You can Google it if you're not familiar with the term EEOC, okay? Spirit messages you have for some Spirit messages you have signed, Virgo. The past is about to catch up with Virgo in a huge way. For some, it's a toxic air sign family member. The past is about to catch up with the uh, Virgo in a huge way. For some of you guys, it's a uh, a toxic air sign family member. So you plug in and how it resonates. So some kind of, I feel that can go positive or negative for whoever that's for. The past is about to catch up with you in a huge way. So if you put good into the universe, then I'm assuming good things are going to come to you. Um, that could be positive. But if you put negative into the universe, I'm assuming the negative karma bank is going to want to feel its karma. And I'm assuming negative is going to come from you. So you have to plug yourself in wherever you resonate and fit. If you do fit there, Virgo. But some kind of past is about to catch up. Come back, call it. Come back knocking, basically, to a Virgo's life. Um, I feel they can go positive or negative. Only you know what you put into the universe, not anybody else, okay? You have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, how that resonates, okay? And for one of you guys, the past about to catch up is a very toxic air sign family member. So, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, family member, masculine or femme. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, and hammer, Jupiter charts. However, that resonates and applies for you, Virgo. Okay? Spirit message to have some, Virgo. We have mouse and frog. For some, you could be dealing with another earth sign or a um, water sign. If you are, they could have um, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, node, main, hammer, Jupiter charts, if you are. Experiments to do to have some Virgo. A Virgo's grandchild is about to speak to police investigators. They're not going to tell you they're going to do this. This is going to become very significant in your life. Oh, my Lord. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates, Virgo. So one of you guys has a grandchild, a masculine or feminine grandchild, a village your grandchild. It could be a biological grandchild or a... Um, Adopted grandchild, you plug it in how it resonates, but masculine or femme grandchild, I heard they're going to speak to police investigators soon, um, but they're not going to tell you they're going to police, speak to police investigators. I heard it's about to become very significant in your life. For some, this is going to go very positively for you. For some, very negatively. For some, this is going to go very positively for you. For some, very negatively. So for some of you guys, the uh, grandchild speaking to the police investigators is going to go very positively for you. For some, it's going to go very negatively. Um, you have to plug this in your own life, how it resonates, Virgo. Um, you only, you know what you've been involved in, with, not anybody else. But whoever that's for, masculine or femme Virgo, you're old enough to have, have a grandchild, either an adopted grandchild or a biological grandchild, whoever you are, sir or ma'am. Spirit messages you have signed, Virgo. You have tree and patience with the frog and mouse. Number 16 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 16, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. 
or any other significant number in one's life. Number 16. A Virgo is about to really, really regret picking a Pisces over a Leo in a huge way. A huge way. For some, it's a masculine Pisces. For some, it's a femme Pisces. Okay, I heard a um, Virgo is about to re really regret picking a, um, a Pisces over a um, Leo. Um, I heard for some, it's a masculine Pisces you picked. For some, it's a femme Pisces you picked. But um, soon, you're about to really regret picking this masculine Pisces or this femme Pisces over a Leo. So, uh, Masculine or femme Leo, they could have Leo in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, Moon, Haven, or Jupiter charts. If that resonates and applies for you, um, Virgo, whoever you are. Um, parrot, someone will gossip about all your secrets, bowl, plenty of material things, table, hard work ahead. A patient complaint is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. And a patient admission is about to become very significant in a Virgo's life. Okay, so patient energy. So I feel you work somewhere that has patients, whoever you are, Virgo. Uh, this is workspace energy. Um, I feel um, I feel you have a patient um, or you work with patients. How that resonates? I heard a patient complaint is about to become very significant or you're the patient. How that resonates for some you could be the patient you plug in how it resonates patient complaint energy and patient emission energy is about to become very significant in a virgo's life so you could be the patient that's about to be admitted into somewhere um a hospital-esque energy or a clinic or a long-term care or assisted living or something of that nature you could be a patient admitted somewhere and you're the admitted patient that's significant or you are complaining if you're the patient complaining on something or you could work at somewhere like a hospital skilled nursing clinic or somewhere that has patients and somebody complains on you or complains on somebody else or um um a significant patient is admitted somewhere some kind of patient admission that's significant and patient complaint energy um so I think it might be an earth sign that's about to be emitted or complains, possibly for some. Uh, we have earth sign energy. Mouse, um, they're going to um, complain or you're going to complain. About to do it very sneakily in secret. About to do it very sneakily in secret is what I heard. So you could be the patient that's about to do it very sneakily in secret or um, somebody's going to complain or uh, and, and I heard patient admission. So they're either admitting something as a patient, like a confession, or they're being admitted somewhere. How that resonates? I heard admission. So they're either being admitted somewhere or they're admitting, like admitting the truth. How that resonates? Uh, Heard they're going to do it secretly and secretly, secretly and secretly. I can't speak secretly and sneakily. Um, like a mouse is secret and sneaky. So they're either doing this to you or you are this person. Um, how that resonates, Virgo? I'm not sure. Frog.
false worker compensation claims are about to become very significant in Virgo's life. Long-term disability benefits that were paid to the wrong person is about to become significant in Virgo's life. And short-term disability benefits that were paid to the wrong person is about to become significant in Virgo's life. And in a stolen inheritance that was given to the wrong person is about to become significant in a Virgo's life. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. That's a lot of theft. So this could be you that stole or somebody you're connected to that stole. Somebody stole somebody's short-term disability benefits, long-term uh, disability benefits, uh, a false uh, workers' compensation, false workers' compensation claim, um, and stolen inheritance that was given to the wrong person somehow this is about to become significant in your life virgo one of these is about to become significant or two or two plus of these it could be you that stole these or somebody you're connected to for some it could be a water sign or earth sign or you only you know if you stole somebody's short-term disability long-term disability benefits workers compensation um benefits uh fall a false workers compensation claim or um Stole somebody's inheritance. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, Virgo. Another death to a disbanded Black Magic Coven is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. For some, you're a very popular online social media reader. You will get a call from an investigator about this. For some, you live in a toxic community where the Black Magic Coven was disbanded. You're about to get communication from an investigator. Oh, my Lord. I've been picking this up and picking this up and picking this up. So, another death is about to occur regarding a disbanded Black Magic Coven. I've been picking this disbanded Black Magic Coven up for a minute in my readings. A hot minute. Um... But since it's been disbanded, there's been deaths. There was a death that occurred before the disbanded Black Magic Coven, and there's been two since that I picked up. There might have been more it's other black, disbanded Black Magic Covens. But the one that I've been picking up, since it's been disbanded, there's been two deaths already. And it's been happening quick. There was one before it disbanded. Um, for one of you guys, you're a popular online social media platform reader. You might be the same one that was in a secret relationship with a cancer femme or not i don't know but um you're one i'm picking up a heavy popular online social media platform virgo uh masculine or femme but i heard basically you're about to get a call from an investigator soon regarding this death online popular social media platform virgo uh reader um it might be a water sign that passed away or it might be any other sign but um, I'm looking at the rain here. I'm thinking it's it's about to start raining. It's about to start pouring with this Black Magic Coven um, energy. Um, there's already been two deaths since the disbandment, and I'm just being for real. So you plug it in how it resonates. The bottom's about to fall out with this. And this Virgo is highly intuitive, the reader, and she is about to reveal everything she knows. For one, it is a masculine. Oh, there's two of you. There's two online pop popular social media platform readers. One, you're a masculine. One, you're a femme. There's two of you. Okay. Sounds like maybe both of you guys are about to get calls from investigators. Because um, I heard um, there's one, you're masculine. One, you're a femme. I heard you're going to reveal everything you know once you get the call from the investigator. I heard the bottom's about to fall out. And I feel the rain was significant on this card. I think the deaths are going to start keep coming um, because they're not got their energetic supply anymore and um, they'll not be able to feed and suck off energy anymore. Um, I don't know. I mean, I only learned this crap from two and a half years of pulling this crap in my reading. So, how that resonates. But um, all I know is deaths are starting to occur from a disbanded Black Magic COVID. Uh, but somehow you guys were connected to this disbanded Black Magic COVID popular online popular social media platform readers. Ma one masculine at least, one feminine, feminine at least, popular online social media platform, Virgos. Sounds like you're both going to get phone calls. I heard you're both going to reveal everything you know. But uh, I'm telling you right now, there's already been deaths. If you didn't know, there's already been deaths. Like deaths plural to this. 
Um, one, these are for YouTube, online popular social media platform readers. And another one, you guys, you live in the toxic community where the disbanded um, COVID is currently at. I heard you're going to you're gonna get um, communication from an investigator, too. I think it's probably a different investigator, I'm presuming, or maybe the same one. You plug it in, how it resonates. There's at least three, you guys. You plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, this is crazy. You plug it in, how it resonates. Uh, you have to plug yourself in where you fit, okay? Oh, my God. I heard you guys are very highly intuitive. So I think that's why you're about to start speaking on everything you know. And honestly, I would too. I mean, not that I know any of this crap. I only pull it in from spiritual downloads. But I would too. Because um, you don't want to get involved in anything like that. And that's just the truth. A Virgo is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. A Virgo is getting a huge wake-up call. Huge. Mm. Tree. A not-so-secret child of the Virgos is about to come very, very, very public. Not-so-secret child anymore. A not-so-secret child of the Virgos is about to come very, very, very public. Not-so-secret anymore. So you plug it in how it resonates. So at one time the child was secret, I'm presuming, or was being kept secret, or was strategically being hush-hush, some kind of secret child energy, but I heard... They're not so secret anymore. So they're very public. They're about to go very public. And the child's not going to be a secret anymore. So family tree energy, um, not so secret child energy. Um, it is a child of yours, Virgo. You could be a femme or a masculine. I'm feeling for a lot of you guys, you're masculine. And you're probably trying to keep the child hidden or something. But um, it, they cannot be hidden. Uh, you can't just hide a child. Um and that's just the truth. So they should have never been secret to begin with, in my opinion. But I'm not you. But I heard they're not secret anymore. They're about to go very public. So whether the, you are a man or a woman and you're making them public, I'm not sure. But you shouldn't try to keep the child secret anyways. Um, that's just the truth. Why they were trying to be kept secret, I have no clue. But you plug it in, how it resonates. And a very significant storm coming up, upcoming in the universe. A very large piece of timber is about to fall on a hotel soon. For one, a home. It's about to come very, very, very significant in Virgo's life. For one, it's a rental property. For one, it's not. For one, it's the hotel. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So, um... Physical tree energy here. Physical tree. Um, there's. I heard an upcoming thunderstorm. A huge thunderstorm about to come soon. So, you know, tree and the thunderstorm. I think of that too with the rain. Um, physical thunderstorm coming, upcoming in the universe. And it sounds like it's going to be a very, very, very bad one. So bad it's about to either uproot a tree or cause lightning to strike a tree or the wind to overturn a tree is what it sounds like. Some on a hotel, some on a, um, a home. Some it's a rental home, some it's not a rental home. So I'm assuming somebody, it's their their home that they're paying mortgage for, paid off, and they live in the home. For some, I feel it's their rental home. For some, I feel it's your rental home or your home home. Um, for some, it could be somebody you're connected to. Um, but for some, it's a hotel. So you might own this hotel or you might live in the hotel or you might know somebody that stays in this hotel. You have to plug it in how it resonates, but however that resonates, significant upcoming thunderstorm energy with the rain and the trees, physical tree uprootment or tree falling on the hotel or the rental home or the home, whether it's your home, somebody you're connected to's home, your rental home, somebody you're connected to's rental home, your hotel or somebody you're connected to's hotel or somebody you know stays in a hotel. However that resonates, okay? It's about to become very significant in your life. But it's about to start with a huge thunderstorm. Sounds like upcoming in the universe.
And someone pregnant with triplets is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. And someone pregnant with triplets is about to become very significant in a Virgo's life. Holy crap, I'm holy man. So somebody's pregnant with triplets. Um, whoever is pregnant with triplets, holy crap. I, whoa, Lord, you plug it in, how it resonates. Whew, not I, said the little red hand. No more buns in this oven, and that's just the daggum truth. Ever, ever, ever. Somebody pregnant with triplets is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. So this could be you that's impregnated this person with triplets, Virgo, or you are impregnated with triplets, or somebody you're connected to is impregnated with triplets. Three gestations in that womb. Holy moly. Patience. A very angry father of someone you really care about is about to really blow up on them. It's about to upset you in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. A very angry father is about to blow up on someone you care about. It's about to upset you in a huge way. So it's not you they're about to blow up on. If that message applies for you, Virgo, it's somebody you care about. Um, you care about deeply whoever this person is. It could be anybody. It could be your your child. It could be um, a family member. It could be your spouse, your partner, um, a community member, a coworker. It could be anybody you care about. But um, it's they're not gonna blow up on you. It's the um, their father is about to blow up on them. Their angry father is about to blow up on them. But you are gonna hear about. The angry father blowing up on them, Virgo, you are, and it's going to upset you. So it's not you that's about to get blown up on by the angry father. It's your person you care about that's about to get blown up by the blown up on by the angry father. Um, he for one, he's an alcoholic. For one, it's about money. For one, he's an alcoholic, and for one, it's about money. So. For one, he's an alcoholic, and he's about to blow up on this person you care about, Virgo. For one. He uh, is about money, angry father energy, um, and it's about to piss you off because you care about this person. Um, th that's terrible. So I think you need to be patient and kind of like hold your tongue and just be there like a support system to this person. That's what I would do. I'd be a support system to this person, be a stable, steady, air, um, earth sign energy, strong, dependable, reliable for this person, like a shoulder to lean on, ear to listen. Um, they might be emotional over this, um, especially having to deal with the alcoholic father. I couldn't imagine. Uh, my father was amazing when I grew up, and he was my foster father, but he was amazing. I, he was not an alcoholic. He was not a drug user. He was amazing, so I couldn't imagine having to deal with the alcoholic father, so I'm trying to say. So, if I was you, of course, you could take the advice or leave it. I'd be very strong and dependable and reliable to this person and just kind of be a shoulder to lean on, kind of like a tree that withstands wind and... Um, rain and the elements but you plug it in how it resonates virgo parrot someone will gossip about all your secrets There is about to be a huge work of work investigation regarding a lot of complaints and a significant hidden camera in a residence room to build a case is about to become very significant in a Virgo's life. Skilled nursing facility. Okay. Oh, Lord, I heard there's about to be a huge work investigation soon. Um, so if this resonates for you, you work in the workplace, I'm presuming, Virgo, or somebody you're connected to does. You work in a workplace situation where there's about to be a lot of complaints. I heard a lot, a lot, a lot of complaints. Um, and there's about to be a huge work investigation regarding all these complaints. Um, so I think you work in this workplace situation or you're about to investigate these um, work complaints. However, that you plug into this situation. Or you could, could be connected to somebody that um, is um, works in this workplace that um, is about to receive all these complaints. Or you could be the person that's about to complain in this workplace and cause the complaints. However that resonates. 
Um, I heard the workplace is about to be investigated. A hospital for one, a clinic for one. A hospital for one, a clinic for one. Walmart for one, Walmart for one. And a restaurant for one. A hospital for one, Walmart for one, a clinic for one, and a restaurant for one. So you plug it in how it resonates. And for one of you guys, you work in a long-term care facility, or you are a patient in a long-term care facility, or you are a family member of someone in a long-term care facility, somebody is building a case that um, sounds like currently in the energetic space, and I've been picking this up in my readings too for the last couple months. Somebody's been picking up, um, somebody has placed a hidden camera in a, um, the, in a patient's room. Um, the patient, I'm assuming the patient has consented and agreed to have this hidden camera in their room, in their resident room. Um, and they've been having it in their resident room to build a case. And I heard that's about to become very significant in Virgo's life too. So I feel you could be the family member that helped implant this um, hidden camera in your um, resident's room with the consent, I hope, of the resident, or you are a healthcare worker that takes helps take care of this um, resident in a skilled nursing facility, because I heard specifically skilled nursing facility, or you are the resident of this person um, in the skilled nursing facility. However that resonates, Virgo, you plug it in how it resonates, okay? But someone will gossip about all your secrets. I think that's the investigation in the workplace situation upcoming with all these complaints. And um, the um, some, somebody out in the universe is building a case through a hidden camera energy in their own resident room in a skilled nursing facility. And I think they're about to release it or they're gossiping to their family members about this or their friends or something of that nature. You plug it in how it resonates. A Virgo is about to lose a ton of money in an underground betting ring. A ton of money. It's about to put them in dire financial straits. Okay, I heard a Virgo is about to lose a ton, ton of money in an underground uh, betting ring. It's about to put them in dire financial straits. So someone will gossip about all your secrets. Uh, I guess when you lose for the one particular Virgo that's about to lose. <clears throat> excuse me. A ton of money in this underground um, betting ring. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, I think somebody's going to gossip about all this money loss, this huge money loss. And that's just for one of you guys. Hopefully you plug it in how it resonates. Plenty of material things. A yard sale is about to become significant in a Virgo's life. For some, a community yard sale. For some, a family yard sale. For one, you're going to be shocked because you're going to need a permit for this yard sale. You did not in the past. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So, um, you got lots of yard sale energy and it's a beautiful time to do it. Just saying, just saying. It, it is. Um, one of you guys, it sounds like you're about to do this yard sale or you're about to patronize this yard sale or you know somebody that's about to do this yard sale. Virgo, how that resonates. For one, it's a family yard sale. For one, it's a community yard sale. So I feel community might be everybody and their mama in the community getting together and putting all their goods and services at one location. Uh, for one, it's a family. So I think all the family members that want to participate come to one location and they put all their goods and services at one location. Um, but I heard uh, whoever's about to do this yard sale, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, um, they're about to um, need a permit. I heard a permit. Um, they've done yard sales in the past, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. It didn't sound like they needed the permit in the past, but they're going to need it now. So some kind of yard sale per, uh, permit to do a yard sale. 
Um, it sounds like from the city that they reside in or city you reside in or town or location or province you reside in. Um, I, whoever this is, I heard they're going to be shocked um, that they're going to need it. Uh, it sounds like they've done the yard sales previously, but they didn't need the permit in the past, but they're going to need it now. So plenty of material things, getting rid of all the stuff they don't use or want the extra money from the yard sale. One Virgo is about to learn of a water sign feminine's huge spending habits. Huge. It's about to turn them off in a huge negative way. One Virgo is about to learn of a water sign uh, fem's huge spending habits. It's about to turn them off in a huge negative way. So plenty of material things. Um, this Virgo, um, sorry, not this Virgo, this uh, water sign fem loves to spin, 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 and she loves, she's very materialistic. Um, whoever you are, Virgo, I don't think you're materialistic or you like to save money. I hope that resonates. But however she's connected to you, I don't know if she's somebody you're dating or your spouse or your um, significant other or a family member or what have you, what have you. Um, I feel she's probably somebody you're dating or a spouse because why would you be so, so um, interested in her spending habits? I mean, if she's just somebody you're just connected to, why are you so nosy and how much she spends you see what i'm saying so i think it's somebody you're anticipating on spending building a life with possibly you plug it in how it resonates but um she loves to spend and you're about to find out she does so she loves the material things um she loves to spend um but it sounds like she probably has the money to do it um you plug it in how it resonates i don't judge if you have the money to do it and it's your money to do it as long as you're not stealing from others um that, that's just me though but you know hey I'm not you, Virgo. One Virgo is about to get a new vehicle soon. One's about to move into a new home. One Virgo is about to get a new vehicle soon, and one's about to move into a new home. So you plug it in how it resonates. So congrats. It could be a new, new home or a new to you home, and one you're about to get a new vehicle, new to you vehicle, or, um, or a new, new vehicle. How that resonates. Hard work ahead. A Virgo is about to move, make the decision to move far, far, far location soon. They know it's going to be hard at first, but they're about to do it. They know it's the best thing for them, and intuitively, they're right. It is. Very toxic place they're at now. Very toxic, and they know this. Highly intuitive. Okay, well, congratulations, Virgo, whoever this is for. So you're highly intuitive. You know wherever you're at now, whether I don't know if you're in the workforce or not, or you have your own business or not. I don't know your personal situation, whoever this is for. But wherever you're at is very toxic, I'll tell you that. Whatever you're around or people you're around or places you're around is very toxic. Um, and you're about to make the hard decision, I heard, um, to move. Uh, I don't think you want to, but you know it's best for you because I heard you know it's best for you. Um, and I heard you're right. You're right about that. You're highly intuitive and you are right. It is the best thing for you. Um, but it sounds like moving would be the best thing for you. You know this. But I think it's going to cost time and money and maybe material resources or et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Maybe that's probably why you were on the fence about it. But I heard you're about to do it. You're about to do it. You're going to put the hard work ahead. Um, it might be um, renovating your home like me possibly, or it might be um, selling a home or um, finding a job or if you have kids, finding substantial education for them, um, however that resonates. But relocating is a huge thing if it's more than just you. And that's the truth, especially if you have like homed upkeep like me or 
um, kids like me or things like that. It's a huge thing. Um, so I don't know your, your status here, Virgo, but you are about to, uh, whoever you are, you're about to do it. You're about to put the hard work ahead and make the leap and move far places. So you plug it in how it resonates, Virgo. Congratulations, whoever that's for. And a failed test soon in a workplace situation, failed test after failed test after failed test after failed test is about to become very significant in Virgo's life. Transfer for one. You're not going to like this. Okay, wow. Okay, so I heard a failed test after failed test after failed test after failed test. After, basically, it sounds like you have been failing a test time after time after time after time again in a workplace. So kind of workplace education or somebody you're connected to has. Um, but however that resonates, it sounds like the person that's been continually failing this test, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, it sounds like they're about to be transferred. Whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, and I heard they're not going to like it. So transferred to somewhere else in their company or facility or unit or um, location or what have you, what have you. Uh, they're going to have hard work ahead um, at wherever the new place they're going because what, there's some kind of test either you or somebody you're connected to keeps failing. Um, so it sounds like it's a requirement for wherever they're currently at, but they keep failing it. So they're about to be transferred, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. You plug it in, how it resonates, Virgo. Government secrets are about to be revealed. Government secrets are about to be revealed. That's what I heard, Virgo. Government secrets are about to be revealed. One, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, I heard for one, uh, oh, I don't want the Secret Service calling me or Homeland Security calling me. I'm just saying. I heard one, you work in the Secret Service. And I'm just being for real, for real. I heard one, you work in the Secret Service. I right, just, for real, for real. That's what I just heard. Why are you work in the Secret Service? Why are you watching a single mom from Alabama? Um, because I'm exposing everybody's secrets. Um, I whoa. Um, I heard government secrets are about to be revealed, and then I heard one you work in the Secret Service. Plug the messages in how they resonate, you guys. Just saying, just saying. Oh my God. <laughs> One, you work for the feds. So one, you work for the feds. One, you work for federal agents. One, you work for Secret Service. Well, we're just pulling that whole host of you guys out in here, aren't we? One, you're RN in a hospital. One, you're LPN. One, you're RN in a hospital. One, you're LPN. So you could be LPN in a hospital or LPN anywhere else. One, you work at a skilled nursing facility. One, you work at a skilled nursing facility. One, you work at a call center. When you work at a call center. One, you work for the government. One, you work for the government. Uh, I don't know if that's local or state or um, federal level for the government part. I'm not sure. I don't think you're the Secret Service person or the Fed. Federal agent, I'll just tell you that. I think you're somebody else. Um, if it's a local level, that could be child protective services or any other local service of government. If it's state, I mean, whatever state government that is and federal, um, you plug it in how it resonates. But yikes. One, you're a customer service representative. When you work in a mechanical shop, when you work in a mechanical shop, when you're a customer service representative, um, you plug it in, how it resonates. 
One, you're a logger. One, you're a logger. One, you're unemployed. One, you're unemployed. One, you're a stay-at-home mother. One, you're a stay-at-home mother. So you plug it in how it resonates. Well, that's a wide variety of you guys. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. One, you're a patient care assistant. Many jobs. Many jobs. And one, you're a patient care assistant. Many jobs. So you plug it in how it resonates, Virgo. All right. Well, I love you guys so much. I hope everybody has a good day. And namaste.